Hi everyone, Amy Love here, and I'm coming on today to share with you my October design team project. And apparently Ruger has something to say about it too. Um, I hope you're all doing well, and I can't wait to share these with you. So, um, Angel Dream Crafts Kim on Etsy is just full of new laces. Ruger concurs, they're all beautiful. And I can't wait to share some of these with you. So let's just jump right in. So you know what an amazing selection of dangles she has. And then she got in this new dangle here that I love. Like I just wanna put bling on these, on the ends of these. I just wanna bling them up. So I'm sure that will be happening, right? It's just gorgeous. What a pretty, pretty dangle lace that is. Just love it. I'm going to leave it right here. It's so pretty. And then this one, you guys. This is like a peacock lace. Which way does it go? This way. I'm pretty sure it's this way. But look at that. The color is beautiful. It's like a really beautiful ivory, kind of creamy. It's got a beautiful shine. Look at that. Isn't that just a gorgeous lace? And it has all these really dainty, delicate bits hanging off the bottom, which are just gorgeous. That is a pretty, pretty, pretty lace. There's no way you'll be able to see all the laces. They're just too, too many, too pretty. But I will do, do my best here. <laughs> Love. Let's fix that guy. All right, and then I want to show you the white ones first because I want to save the other ones. There's this one, which is a great snippety snip lace. And if you snippety snip it up, look how many appliques you'll get because I'm thinking I just want to use this. Isn't that gorgeous? Or you could just use that and then this. So then you'd have even more because you'd have the flower and then you'd have, you could use it, I guess, as a tulip or a leaf. It's just... It's so pretty, and so you'd get so many appliques out of this one trim. Just gorgeous. It would also be a really pretty edging on something. What don't you think? That's just really pretty, like around a box or something. Just gorgeous. So pretty. And then here is another, what I like to call snippety snip lace. Look at all the flowers you get, and each one has a pearl. So cute. And then you get the leaves that also are beaded. I mean, that is a lot. You get five, what is that? Five flowers and three leaves in each section. I mean, that is crazy. This could last a really long time if you're using the separate bits. I mean, it's very beautiful to use, you know, all at once too, but look at how much is there. Oh, so excited about it yes all right then there's this lace which honestly i'm probably going to snip snip this one too well i pretty much snip snip them all almost <laughs> but this has a lot to give too i love the leaves and then look at these flowers aren't they pretty they're so pretty so this is another gorgeous snippity snip lace love it it's super pretty put that one right there all right then oh, here's another dangle loving the dangles so much all right look at that okay i think i have had this one before actually and i love to just put pearls on every single one of those and dangle them off of something just gorgeous right and i usually cut it um, into a section so i'll use that section can you see that you know for one dangling off of one thing it's just so cute this is such a beautiful dangle pretty 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 i love this pile of lace i just want to pet it and then this this is such a cute, cute little edging trim. They're little tiny bows. Okay, how am I going to show that to you better? They're little tiny bows. Aren't they cute? That is so, so sweet. I love the bows. 
All right, so this is October, and I am starting my Christmas crafting. I know. Don't anybody get on to me. We haven't even done Halloween yet, but I am just going to skip over Halloween crafting this year and go straight for Christmas, which is what I do most years anyway. I love it. And so the uh, colors that I am going to be working with for Christmas are mint, pink, and gold. Probably no surprise to most of you who've known me for a long time. So she has some really great... Uh, gold pink and mint trims for me so look at this beautiful this is like a really soft it's not even probably gold it's more like a champagne but it would just just gonna go so good with my my mint and pink crafting i absolutely love it and there's so many bits that you could snip off here or you could just use the whole thing one whole applique a flower and a dangle or just use the whole trim it's just beautiful this is really, really pretty, Kim. I'm excited <laughs> about crafting with this gorgeous. Let's see if I can lay that out. Isn't it pretty? It's so pretty. And then oh, oh, I got the mint uh, double polka dotted tool. It's so cute. I need this definitely for the Christmas crafts. They all need a little bit of this for sure. Love it. And then she got this gorgeousness here. Isn't this beautiful? So it's on mint tool, which is exciting because now I have mint tool to add to the projects too. And then look at these flowers. They're mint and gold and pink. Just what I've been looking for. <laughs> My Christmas colors. It's such a big applique too. There's so many great bits here to use. And these flowers are gorgeous with the big bling in the center. They're so dimensional and so, so super pretty. I love them. Gorgeous. So let me show you uh, the embellishments I'm working with. I got some more bows in the uh, dusty pink because those are definitely going on Christmas projects. And she does have bows in different colors. Those are just the colors that I wanted right now. And so I also got these cabochons. They're like vintage, um, vintage girls, I think. Are they, this one looks like an angel. Let's see. They're like vintage girls, I think. Let me get them in my hand where I can show them to you. And they're square, which I do love the square cabochon. Aren't those beautiful? I mean, these images are so, so pretty. I love these and I love the colors. They are just gorgeous. So we've got the square cabochons that are just beautiful. I love those. And then um, let me take this out of the package. This one is a pin. Oh, look at the dangles on this. Look at how beautifully sparkly that is. That is a beautiful piece of bling, Kim. I love it. Here's the back. It's got the pin. Oh, hello. That's gorgeous. That is absolutely gorgeous. All right, and then I got these in pink last month. Um, hmm. You know, it's getting harder and harder for me to see without my cheaters on. And I sometimes cannot see where to open these bags. Okay. I found it. Price is averted because my cheaters are all the way downstairs and I did not want to go do that. This one is in like a clear blue. Oh, these are gorgeous. You, you can't even get a hint of blue on the camera. I think it's just all like that clear gorgeousness, rhinestone shine. Oh, these are so, so pretty. Love. And then I've got a little baggie of bling right here. Oh my God, these are gorgeous. Okay, let me, one bling at a time. So let me start with these. I've had these before and I love them and I want to dangle them off of everything. They're absolutely beautifully sparkly. They're just little dangle heart charms. I love these. So, so pretty. 
So I've got those. And then these, I haven't had these before and they're so cute. And they um, do have like a shank so you can um, either sew them on or hang them off of something. Look at these rhinestone pearl bows. Oh, they're gorgeous. They're absolutely gorgeous. And look at, look at that shank. They're amazing. That is uh, very sturdy. So you could definitely sew that down or hang it like a charm. These are beautiful. I love them. Kim, I love everything you sent me. Everything is gorgeous. Make sure you follow the link below to the store to get you some uh, beautiful goodies to play with. And of course, there's a link below to all the other designers. Be sure you go and check them out. And thanks for watching, everybody. And I will see you guys on the next one.